Yeah, this is the uh, fourth blog. This is the Jubilee Special, as George wants to call it. Have a few red, white, and blue, being patriotic. We've got a Jubilee tomorrow. So, uh, just outside the Tower of London, as you can see. Trying to get uh, patriotism, if you want to say that, ready for the Queen tomorrow. <laughs> Sorry about last week, the fight is actually Thursday the 5th of July, not Friday like we last spoke, but uh, it is at your call. It's uh, Frank Warren and Queensbury Promotions, which is always a good show. I'm not too sure who else is on the bill yet, but I'll find out shortly. Uh, tickets will be on sale in the next couple of weeks, but uh, I'll keep you posted about that through my Facebook and my Twitter. Yeah, so this week, nothing out of ordinary, I'm just about to step up my training. Obviously for my fight, I want to get some quick intervals, some burst scan. But I've absolutely been caning the versa climber at Urban King's Gym. It's getting my sprints down, fast sprints, a little bit of rest, fast sprints again, burst, burst, burst. I'm loving the training at the minute. Completely different to as an amateur, but tough. Sometimes I do struggle to get up in the mornings, but it's going to be worth it in the end. I got my BMI tested about three days ago, which is 9.5% body fat, which is pretty good. Hoping to get down to about 8% for my fight. <laughs> Two favourite tweets this week, I couldn't decide whether or not which one I could pick. First one's from, obviously everyone knows him, The Rock, Dwayne Johnson. He says, we all get the same 24 hours in a day. What we do with it is up to us. Move the crowd. Simple, innit? Make the most of what time we've got here. Second one, not so cool. Not from someone famous. It's from... At Boo You Whore called Charlotte Coville. It's just basically a picture. Yeah, I'd just like to uh, take a second out uh, from the blog just to thank the crew involved and in helping make this happen. These guys are here week in, week out. As you can see, we've got all the equipment, all the gear, security, just in case anyone wants to come across. Uh, I said about groupies, but I tell you what, it's been a joke lately. This guy is unreal. He takes me from a mall. So uh, just thanks to you guys. Round of applause. Thank you. Yeah, so last night I was at the at my old amateur boxing club at Brentwood Youth. There was at the golf course over in Essex Country Club. Had a good show. All the seniors done well. I think all the seniors won. But uh, I was especially impressed with team captain Ryan Gunning, who boxed really well. Boxing and moving, boxing and moving, which is best at. And also my little mate Reggie Buckley. Uh, after a year out, he's come back and absolutely annihilated the geezer. Stopped him in the third round. But uh, these are both on my Twitter, so if you have a word of them, they're on there as well. Right, this, this week's question of the week is from a girl called Sam Gilman. It says, hi, Sam here. I'd like to know what is your incentive to train every day when you could easily put it off? Well, it's, it's the simple fact of if you don't train every day, you're never going to be successful. This is one of the hardest sports out there. I've got to train hard. If I want to win, I've got to get up and do my five o'clock runs. I've got to do my sessions here and there, even when I'm tired. I've got to diet, I've got to do this and I've got to do that. All the best do it, why should I not? Bam. Yeah, so I'm looking for um, a quick theme tune to start off the blog with each time. So if any of you can put a little saying together, saying funny, quirky, whatever, just let us know, send it over. 
and also suggestions for me theme, uh, me entrance music. Obviously, I've only got like five, five and a half weeks to go, so anything you can suggest, just let us know about that. Send it over on Twitter or whatever. George. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so if you've got any uh, suggestions for our videos, our blogs or whatever, just uh, contact us there. Contact us on our Twitter and that. And uh, also if you've got any funny tweets, just send them over because I love it. I'm on it all day long, on and off. So yeah, that's it really. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my Twitter's been off the hook at the minute. I'm getting tweets from such people as Warrior Boxing, uh, ExpertBoxing.com, Mickey Elliott, uh, Mark Tibbs was tweeting me the other day. He's impressed with the video. Um, well, Versa Climber. I've got a few MMA fighters looking out for me as well. So all in all, I'm just creating a nice following. I'm thanking you all for it as well. Thanks a lot. finish off today just like to congratulate the Queen Her Majesty for uh, what is it Diamond Jubilee or something today whatever Jubilee it is we'll uh, hold on hold on he's got 20 quid in his wallet look you give a 20 quid a kiss let there we go as for the Queen congratulations and uh, this one that one's for me so, thanks again for watching, just let your friends know, and uh, we'll be back again next week. Putting a few photos up on Facebook this week and some more training, but other than that, we'll see you soon.